Christmas has arrived on the BT set thanks to Toad Hall Toys. We have Kari England joining us. Kari, thank you for bringing so many great gift ideas this morning. Oh, you're more than welcome. And I must say it was hard to even choose. We have so many things to offer. Well, I mean, the best thing to do is to hit up your shop in the Exchange District because it's so fun going in there. And it's, it's loaded with these timeless toys, these things that we're going to be able to use over and over again. And, Parents and grandparents and kids all get to play with and enjoy. Absolutely. All right, let's uh, let's start off here and do a little bit of a tour. So, which end do you think is going to make the most sense to work our way through? Oh wow, well, we're closest um, to this one. Oh, well, apparently we're being interrupted. First so. of all, let's, we? let's meet this uh, gentleman. <laughs> this is one of uh, about 200 different puppets that we have to offer at Toad Hall. 200. 200. I know it's quite oh, hard to dear. believe. Um, they're stuffed animals, but they've also got a personality, or at least one you can give them. Again, a great example of something that's going to use hours and hours and hours of fun and creativity and never grow out of or become tired of. You can even be a grown man and still be doing British accents for a seal. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to... Please donate to the World Wildlife Foundation. Protect the seals. This is great because you can't not put it on. You, if you put it on, you can't not play. Well, I handed it to you and you haven't given it back. Yeah. <laughs> Well, it's also warm, too. <laughs> but it's a great example of getting kids up to give them something and let them be creative, and you'd be amazed what they're going to come up with. And no batteries. No batteries. Like most just of the things that you said you have on display here, we don't have to uh, muck around with any of those things. We can just jump into playing right away. Absolutely. Um, I think imagination, creativity is are, are building blocks of childhood. Um, I, I don't think uh, keeping kids just plugged into something is the way to go. All right, so let's get creative with a whole bunch of different things. Like, uh, I don't, what about this one? This one's just weird. It's just weird. It looks uh, awesome. It's called Squeaks. Yeah. Um, really, it's suction cups. Um, I love the display unit because the suction cups actually stick to it. They'll stick to walls, take it in the bathtub, stick to each other, make jewelry, Perfect. create just all sorts of weird critters. Cool. What's it called? Squigs. Squigs. Sounds good. Squigs. Sweet. I like this one. This is what, a big hit in my family. Yeah, I'm, here for I'm the older kidding. kids too. Well, little, sometimes we let the little kids play too. It's it's a version of Tiddlywinks, but not but you don't need quite as much dexterity. Push down on the frog's bum, try to get it to jump into the pot. Tons of fun. Going and on. a couple of things that you've probably seen um, in TV, movies, or you know that other people had growing up. You didn't know that you could actually buy them, including um, Bozo the Clown, correct? Oh, yes, yeah, yeah. Bozo the Bob Clown, on. nice and heavy, sand weighted. So, give him a little poke and he'll pop right back up at you. It's a good fitness routine for the kids. <laughs> sure. Keep them on their toes, burn off some of that Christmas energy. Uh, well, if you really want them to burn off some energy, you can give them a mugs. Um, this is a device that uh, comes with uh, directions and ingredient lists and put the ingredients inside, get the kids to shake it for two minutes and they've got their own ice cream. Oh my gosh, are you serious? And it's really good. My son made it a couple of years ago. Some cream and some salt and some ice and a whole lot of fun. How I fitting know. that it's a penguin too making the ice cream for you. <laughs> great touch. Uh, there's too many great mean things. How about the okay. chicken game? How does that one work? Oh, it's a memory game for kids. You've got a little chickens, you put them on the nest sitting over their eggs. Kids have to make sure when they lift the chicken there's an egg underneath or else they lose one turn. Oh. It's a very simple first memory game. Nice little memory Everybody game. Can play. I like Actually, it. Very good Three dimensional idea. and tactile. Um, um, hey, what about uh, the aspiring magicians? Um, you got some great kits that are going to help them out as well, correct? Uh, yes. Didn't bring any. Uh -huh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Thing, that's shadow puppets. I thought it was like magician hands no, and dove appear. No, but we do have Because I know that a lot of magicians go to Toad Hall Toys to pick Absolutely. up the kids. Absolutely. We have a full magic department at Toad Hall with magicians on staff. Perfect. All right. So here's the thing. What do we do for the I just don't know what to get that kid problem? Come in. Talk to one of us. Tell us your price range. Tell us a bit about them. We'll give you many options to choose from. Awesome. What about the uh, uh, permanent man-child who's in his late eight twenties uh, who wants something fun? We'll send them to one corner of the store, which we call our adult fun area. Oh, you don't great. need to be eighteen plus. It's just lots of ideas, great gifts for people at the office, or you've got that secret Santa gift. You just don't know what to get. Tons of fun things. Best thing to do: stop by the shop in person in the Exchange District. We have the information on the BT website, BreakfastTelevision.ca, so you can connect folks at Toad Hall Toys. Kari, thanks for being on the show today. My pleasure. Thank you. Taking a quick break. More coming up after this on BT. Santa Claus is coming to town.